Hey guys, I'm Mae Moldez and we're here at the premiere of The Passage on Fox and we're going to talk to some of the cast, so stay tuned. So after seeing the first two episodes, what was it like seeing everything come to life and come together? Um, well, for me, I'm always pleasantly shocked by how things turn out well uh, and I, I couldn't be happier with the, with the final product. Um, I, of course, can't say that about myself in the projects, but I, I can say that about my cast and everyone else. I'm, I'm too hard on myself. So I, I look at myself and I'll critique too much. But the product itself with the cast and, the, and everything that, uh, with all the effects, and it's just, it's an un unbelievable show. It's a show that I would watch without myself in it. <laughs> so you've worked with a lot of projects before. What makes this one stand out? Uh, well, this is the biggest project I've been a part of for broadcast, uh, to have Matt Reeves and, and Ridley Scott attached to it. Liz Heldens uh, wrote the, the uh, she's the showrunner. Um, it's a super ambitious show, so it's by far the biggest project I've been a part of. What was it like when you found out you got the role? <laughs> Want to know what's funny? I celebrated with a burger. I ate burgers because I was so happy. I ate burgers. Oh, which kind? What kind of burgers? Where at? It was like at this little spot down by Fox Studios that my mom used to go to all the time when she was a kid. Can't remember what it's called right now, but it was the best burger of my life. I'm sorry, it beat In and Out. Like, can you believe it? In and Out. I believe it. I'm not, I'm not a fan of In and Out too much. I feel like. Yeah, I mean, I love In and Out, but like that beat it. I can't. I hands down. <laughs> I believe you. So, what was it like playing your character? Amy Belafonte. It was great because to connect to her, you know, I always connect to whatever my character is going through. I'm going through. So, it was a challenge to just connect to being, like, having to lose a parent. Thank goodness I haven't lost a parent, but the feeling of losing someone. Um, to just have that responsibility and be tough like her. I thought it was great, and um, you know we both have some similarities that I brought to the table. It was fun. After seeing the pilot for the very first time, what was the feeling like? Finally seeing everything come together. Well done. Oh, that's a very good question. Um, when did I see it? I saw it. Well, here's the thing. I saw it on my Vimeo. They sent me a link to it, and then again I saw it at Comic Con. Um, I guess the first time you watch something, you're always watching for your, yourself. You know, how, how did I do? I guess most actors do that because their egos are just so big. Uh, and the second time you watch it for story. Uh, and then, um, so usually the second viewing is always better because you forgive yourself and go, this is a good story, am I into it? Do, who do I care for? And um, I really, the second time I watched it, I really enjoyed Sanaya and uh, Mark Paul. I thought that their story was going to get the audience. Uh, and, and we really need that. We need the audience to fall in love with Sanaya, with Amy Belafonte, and also, you know, Brad Wolgast. Um, and I think that works. The pilot really is a setup for the show. What's it about? Who's, who's in it? And what's their role, I think? You know, I think episode two, episode, they get, the episodes get progressively better. And um, you get to know, far, obviously, a lot more about them. But yeah, the pilot's always, I always feel pilots are like a setup. Like, what, what is the show about? Am I interested? Will I watch it again? You know. So is this the first time you're seeing the pilot? It is not. I've seen it. I saw. I got to see it at Comic Con and the TCAs. And what did you think about it so far? Seeing the like the pilot the first time. I loved it. It's super exciting because we get to read the scripts together, but you don't obviously see how the other scenes are unfolding that you're not in. So it's just fun to see everyone's stuff. And what was it like working with the cast? incredible. We were so, so lucky. And coming into it, I was already a fan of, uh, of most of the cast who I'd seen all their shows before this, so it's been pretty amazing. It was very emotional. Um, I had a lot of uh, days of uh, crying and, you know, because my character, uh, most of my stuff was with Mark Paul and Sonia, so Brad and Amy Belafonte, and we really have like the heart story of the show and it's you know it was really like we're dealing with very big 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 issues um, that were really emotional so it was a, it was amazing it was also often a lot of tears wow. um, what do you like most about your character is there one I love that she is strong yet vulnerable 
She's fiercely intelligent and courageous. And um, I love that, like, what you see with her is not what you get. Mm. Yeah, so there's, she definitely has some mystery about her. Thank you for watching the premiere of The Passage. If you like what you saw, go ahead and click the like button and subscribe and watch the videos right here on my right.